that familiar sound for those who own a PlayStation and have completed a boss fight, a level up, a time trial, or just a miscellaneous quest. For us completionists, it's all we need to hear to keep going and achieve the Platinum Trophy. Welcome to From Gold to Platinum, a series of videos where we talk about what is needed to get the Plat Trophy of a certain game. Chapter 1 Celeste A little disclaimer before we continue, this is not a step-by-step -step guide. If you need a trophy guide, a link will be posted on the description below for you to follow. We are opening this series with Celeste, a platforming game designed, directed and written by Maddie Thornson. And at first Celeste seems a very innocent and easy game. Well, let me tell you my friend, you're absolutely wrong. If Maddie wanted us to experience hell, I think this is close enough. This story is about a girl called Madeleine in her attempt to climb the mountain called Celeste and solve some mental health issues along the way. And yes, the main protagonist is not called Celeste, the mountain is. The beautiful story is complemented with a great pixel art style work and you can see all the details they put into the art through the different chapters. The music is also one of the great features of this game and I'm gonna leave a link on the description below with a full playlist for Spotify. Because let's be honest, you're not gonna hear a lot of the music with all of the death sounds playing on the background. I miss. You're right. So close. Oh, come on. There's a little bit more than 9k of me <laughs> dying all the time. The first challenge of the game is completing all 8 chapters trying to grab all the collectibles, but if you miss any, don't worry, you can replay the chapters as much as you like. There are 3 main collectibles in the game, consisting in strawberries, cassette tapes and hearts. There are also golden strawberries, but they are not needed for the plat trophy, and they are very hard to get, so I didn't even try. The majority of the trophies are related to grabbing these collectibles or finishing the different chapters. Just remember that grabbing the cassette tapes unlock the B-sides of that chapter. The B-sides are these very difficult levels and in my experience is where I struggle the most. So I'm pretty sure you're gonna be spending quite some time in those levels. There is also a trophy for playing the first version of Celeste, created in a game jam, and it's a very nice addition to the game. And of course, it's not easy at all. Celeste is always rising the difficulty bar little by little, and when you think it can't be more difficult than the B-sides, you get the C-sides. The C-sides are really short levels with just 3 screens, but you're going to have to use everything in terms of skill and reaction to finish these levels. Well, this is in fact uh, the end of one of the B-side stages, but I'm pretty sure you can get the idea of how hard they are. Okay, this is actual footage of a seaside. This is chapter 7 seaside. In fact, it's the last screen, the last of the three screens. This is the last one. And the timer started at 9 minutes and 30 seconds. And as you can see, I was struggling for more than an hour uh, just to finish this part. This part I remember being difficult because of the reaction times were just too small. And as you can see, it took me more than an hour just to finish this part. Yes! Yes! 
it was a long run, uh, very frustrating at times, but the game is so well designed that if you focus and time everything correctly, you can achieve the Platinum Trophy. And as you can see, after 58 long minutes in the last stage, I finally achieved the last trophy to get the Heartbeat Ooh. Platinum Trophy from Celeste. Give it to me, Heartbeat Trophy Earn. Okay, before wrapping up, this is not an easy trophy. Well, in reality, it's not even an easy game. But if you want to play the game but you feel that the frustration might be too high, there is an assist mode that can make the game easier for you. Okay, let's see how my Celeste number stack up. 31 trophies out of 31. It took me approximately 38 hours to complete. And if I have to rate its difficulty, it's definitely an 8 out of 10. If you're going to be using assist mode, uh, it's a 1 out of 10 of difficulty. Okay, that's it for today's video. If I miss anything important, just put it on the comment section below so I can reply. Remember to subscribe to the channel for more from gold to platinum. See you next time. Oh, yeah. So did I. Legend did it too. Oh, Legend did it too. Come on, Legend, you're right there. I can't wait. I, I, I no, no, come on. Fucking hammers. No, I'm just gonna get in. <laughs> what is happening? I told, I told Matt.